Now, as you can see, the chicken coop is in the uproar. Each of the chickens sitting on that many eggs or whatever. I gotta take all these eggs, throw them out. I took their roosting bars out because they won't even go outside to use a potty. They'll just keep going until it makes a big pile. So I just cleaned all those eggs out. Eggs out of that corner, eggs out of that corner. Roosting bar off of that side. Cleaned up most of the poop on this side, yeah, but I'm, I still gotta, um, this one was real determined, so I had to come up in here for this one. I couldn't just reach from here and pull the eggs out or nothing. Um, in a minute, I'm gonna get out. Um, sweet while it's out, replace all the hay. I've got diatomaceous earth, I'm gonna spread down. And then I'm gonna put hay, and then um, pine shavings are over there. And you see her, I forget what you call it, but you see how it's all flat. Um, that's because of uh, lack of eating and stuff. They just want to sit on eggs, sit on eggs, sit on eggs. So I can't allow that to happen. I have to come in here. And, uh, well, I got some dogs out here. I got to let my dogs out because... There's loose dogs out here and I can't have them uh, killing my chickens or nothing like that. I will get right back. So the situation unfolds. There's my dogs there. They move my chickens this way. There's me cleaning out the eggs. I let two of the chickens go back in there. Since these dogs are loose around here. Uh... You know, I just got to keep an eye on things as I do this. So like I said, I'll be putting down diatomaceous surf, fresh hay, and pond shavings. And so I had to take their food inside feeders out so they'll come out. And just chew. So now I got to... just slid out but you know he's acting tough with the pack then when they all ran <laughs> my dude's waiting for him to jump he realized he's a baby but the big ones ran the big ones are teaching these puppies to come on the farm and kill my chickens and uh so my dogs are using the bathroom here letting them know that right here is a no-go zone so it's just crazy how it goes down like that. You know, that's how you can lose animals. And these ain't even the, the vicious ones. These are the dogs. These aren't the coyotes or anything that uh, be out here. Hey, fat boy. Yeah, don't you go under there. Don't be like them losers. So... These are all the young ones. One of them's a little older, but them two, they're puppies. That's one reason why my dog didn't kill them. He realized they babies. But one of the bigger, older ones would have uh, acted up. They're up the road. They done left since then. So, let me get back to what I'm doing. But see, it's little stuff like this that I gotta deal with you don't see coming. He's pissing over there too, marking it. She pissed over there marking it. She, they letting them know um, that they ain't welcome here without actually killing any of them. Action, Nina. So, you see I got every last egg out of there now. Now I'm going to go spread the diatomaceous earth uh, down everywhere. And uh, down there is the remnants of a couple eggs that exploded and made that box there nasty so even though I cleared those boxes I actually filled that one in with dirt so it uh, soak up all that nasty stuff from the exploded egg and it won't be used by them 
uh, until one of them digs it out uh, after it becomes fresh because they won't sit on a nasty spot like that so let me get to it and then update it a little bit okay now I'll throw down the hay now that the dirt is down even though this is dirt this is silica soil so it's dietary grade so it's not harmful you could sprinkle it with some lime to help kill some spe some smell and stuff like that but you can't overdo the lime uh, powder because uh, so much of that will block up their uh, digestive tract but now the hay goes on <laughs> 